Hello friends, welcome back. Welcome to Happy Learning. My name is Arundhat Kaushik and today we are going to expand e raised to power x in ascending powers of x by Maclaurin's theorem. So first of all, we will understand the steps with the help of which we are going to solve this question and then we will actually dealing with the question. Okay. So first step that we will be following to expand e raised to power x in the ascending power of x will be we will have to put this function equals to f of x okay so the given function is e raised to power x which we have to put equals to f of x and then our second step will be we'll have to find various derivatives of this function like f dash of x and then we'll have to find f double dash of x that is the second derivative of this function and then we'll have to find f triple dash of x that is third derivative of this function and so on okay now our third step will be we'll have to find the value of each derivative at zero that means we'll have to find f dash at zero we'll have to find f double dash at zero we'll have to find f triple dash at zero and so on okay now our final step will be once we follow all the above three steps we'll have to put the values of these step uh, the values that we have found in step 2 and step 3 equals to f of x in a way that f of x equals to f of 0 that is functions value at 0 plus x dot f dash of 0 plus x square by 2 factorial dot f double dash of 0 plus x cube by 3 factorial dot f triple dash of 0 and so on okay so now let's move on to our question originally we had uh, f equals to e raised to power x so to solve this question i'd like to take one example and with the help of this example we'll be solving this question very easily okay so what i'm gonna do is that i'm gonna put f of x equals to a raised to power x okay now as I told you, what I have to do, first thing will be, I'll have to put this a raised to power x equals to f of x. Then second thing will be, I'll have to find various derivatives of this a raised to power x. That means the first derivative of a raised to power x will be a raised to power x dot log a. And remember the base will be e. Okay. And the second derivative of this function that is f dash of x or i must say the second derivative of f of x will be a raised to power x dot log e a raised to power 2 and similarly the third derivative will find will be equals to a raised to power x dot log e a raised to power 3 and we can find other derivatives as well okay now if you find nth derivative of this function it will be a raised to power x dot log e a raised to power n now as i told you in the third step what we do we find the value of these functions at zero that means i'll have to find f of zero which will be a raised to power zero equals to one and f dash at zero will be equals to log a and the base is e now i'll have to find f double dash of zero equals to uh, it will be equals to log e a raised to power two and f triple dash of zero equals to log e a raised to power three similarly the value of nth derivative at zero will be equals to log a having the base e raised to power n now come to the fourth step we have to put all these values in a manner that is function equals to f of 0 that is functions value at 0 plus x f dash at 0 that is functions first derivative at 0 and then x square by 2 factorial dot f triple dash of 0 uh, it's not triple dash it's double dash 
okay and then x cube by 3 factorial dot f triple dash of 0 plus dot 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 plus x raised to power n by n factorial dot f of n uh, it's not f of n n at derivative okay at 0 now we found out the value of all these in the previous steps so f dash of 0 will uh, was 1 okay you can check it here the value of f of uh, 0 was 1 and value of f dash of 0 was log a so you can pause the video or rewind back to see these values okay so now x dot value of f dash of a was log a plus x square by 2 factorial value of f dash f double dash of 0 was log a whole square plus x cube upon 3 factorial dot log a raised to power 3 plus dot 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 plus x raised to power n upon n factorial dot log uh, a raised to power n and remember base of each log a is e okay so our original question was we had to find, uh, we had to expand e raised to power x in the ascending power of x. So, what we are going to do, now we have found f dash of x uh, for a raised to power x, okay. It's a raised to power x, okay. Let me just erase it, okay. Uh, okay, it's a raised to power x. So, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to put a equals to e and let's see what happens when I do this then f of a becomes f of x equals to e raised to power x and put the value of a as e in each step then 1 plus x log e at the base of e just erase it okay plus x square by 2 factorial dot log e at the base e raised to power 2 and so on fine now we know that value of log e at base e is equals to 1 okay so what happens in each step where we have log a it will equals to uh, 1 that means from this step we get only x x multiply 1 equals to x plus x square by 2 factorial plus x cube by 3 factorial plus dot 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 plus x raised to power n upon n factorial so this is actually the expansion of e raised to power x in ascending power of x by the help of maclaurin's theorem okay i hope this question is clear to you if you have any query you can post your queries in the comment section i will try to answer your questions as soon as possible okay now study hard take care of yourself See you soon in my next video, very soon. Till then, bye-bye.